So what I've got is I've got one from my YouTube channel, and this came from Rod and Bose Outdoors, which his real name is Dan. I don't actually know who this guy is. Hey, he says, as someone who has been in the insurance industry for over four years, but no claims slash adjusting experience, what difficulties would I face in becoming an independent adjuster? <laughs> which that's a great question. I mean, I was, yeah. I had uh, an insurance license for years where I sold property and casualty and life and health and everything else. I worked for State Farm in an office um, selling those products. And, and and I made the transition, you know, later on. It actually in some ways it helps you, especially on the property side, because if you sell that, you sell that policy, you know, that policy, especially on the, on the, uh, homeowner's policy, you know, it, you live it, you breathe it, you sold a lot of it. Uh, and so you're going to understand the nuances of how, of what, how coverages are and how to look up things in a policy. That's going to help you a lot on the property side. Now, as far as daily claims go on the, on auto, it doesn't matter. Um, it really doesn't affect you either way. There's nothing that's going to hinder you. It's just going to help you. It's going to help you a little bit because you know how to talk to people. But, you yeah. know, I, I know this guy, um, you know, he's one of my fishing buddies, kind of. And uh, what's going to happen is, is that your experience of being on sales is going to help you. Is going to help you out in the field because, again, you're dealing with people every single day. And this is a no matter how you slice it, no matter what you do, no matter what we do every day, it is a people business. And if you can't relate to people, then you just, you've, again, I'm, I say this over and over and over. Yeah. You failed already if you can't deal with people. So, yeah, big time. <laughs> <laughs>